Hello again, Henson Huskies, and welcome back to yet another Books of the Week video feature. As always, we are coming to you with some great recommendations, all of which are new additions to our digital content in Destiny Discover, and one from our Junior Library Guild digital bookshelf. So first, one of the things that we just added is this great new ebook called Root Magic. And Root Magic is just a fascinating story that has a little bit of everything. So the main story is focused on Jezebel or Jez and her twin brother, Jay. It's set in the 1960s and they are going through tons already because it is the South and schools are just starting to integrate. So they have some trouble with that. Their grandmother has recently passed away, but on the other side, they just turned 11 and they are now kind of looped into the family's history of some magic. And it's not just charms and little potions for healing like they thought. It's actually a lot more than that. And Jezebel especially becomes super involved when she realizes the magic is so intense that she's going to need all of the magic she can conjure and some help because pretty soon things start to happen that are not normal around town and some evil and some supernatural come into play and threaten both her family and the whole area. So Jez and Jay need to team up and use their root magic to help everyone. And then another new book that we have for fans of our Percy Jackson and um, Magnus Chase this is a new book that is from Rick Riordan's Recommendations, and it's called City of the Plague God. Now, this is based on ancient Mesopotamian mythology as opposed to like Greek or Roman like we mostly hear about, so you might not know it as well. But in this story, it's still a really epic adventure because the main character, who um, is named Sikander, he is teaming up with this epic hero called Gilgamesh, which might sound familiar. It's a uh, name mentioned in some movies and TV. And they are trying to stop the ancient god of plagues. And the plague god, as in the title, is trying to wipe out Manhattan. And as those of us who have just been living life in a pandemic know, um, plagues are pretty serious and not that the pandemic is the same but it's kind of an interesting fantasy action adventure where they are trying to stop before anything crazy can happen to this huge chunk of people. And once again, we're depending on this young man and his friends to save us, just like our fans of Percy Jackson have come to rely on Percy. You will come to rely on Sikander in this amazing story. Definitely worth checking out. Brand new ebook we just added. And then last but not least is a selection from the Junior Library Guild Digital Bookshelf. Remember that those have the unlimited copies of all their books. And this one is called Famous Last Words. So my mystery, thriller, kind of scary story fans, this is up for you. Famous Last Words has your main character whose name is Willa. And she's starting to panic because she's starting to see things that aren't real. She sees a dead body in the swimming pool. Her reflection doesn't look like her. All sorts of creepy things that you would normally see in like a scary movie trailer. That's what her life is becoming. And at the same time, there's this killer who's stalking people in LA. And she starts to wonder if her visions are connected to these murders somehow. Or is she just going crazy? What's the connection? What's going on? Is she able to do anything or is she in danger herself? You can check it out in Famous Last Words, which is a brand new edition in Junior Library Guild. And there are unlimited copies, so everyone can access this who would like to. That being said, those are the top three recommendations for this week. I know that you are in the final stretch here of your third quarter, so make sure that you are keeping up with that. But if you have the time to check out a new book, please do so. Don't forget to log your reading in Beanstack. And thank you guys so much for all of your support of the library. You have been a fantastic group of readers all year. 
So keep up the great work and happy reading, Henson Huskies.